The small family farm in America is nearing extinction. The total number of farms has fallen from about 7 million in 1935 to about 2 million today. Every week, over 300 farmers leave their land for good. Historically, subsidy dollars have flowed to large farmers and not to small farmers. So for example, in the 15-year period that ended 2010, the federal government handed out $161 billion in direct subsidy payments. Two-thirds of farmers in this country got nothing. Of that $161 billion, one-fifth of the recipients grabbed nine-tenths of the cash. Federal subsidy policy subsidizes four main grains, corn, soybeans, wheat, and rice. And those crops figure heavily in the processed foods that we eat. Two of those, corn and soybeans, also are fed mostly to animals. 